Hey, and welcome to Inacore Gaming. Today is a special edition of World of Warcraft Classic Mondays, but today is Wednesday here at the channel. Here at the channel, we, I, am having a rough spot. It happens to a lot of us. Things have not been going all that well lately. We had a hurricane that destroyed quite a few trees. We were without power for a week. And then just this past weekend we lost my mom and the interesting thing about that is that as I tell you at the end of my videos or try to indicate to you it's my belief that faith has a valuable purpose in your life. I know that it has a valuable purpose in my life. Even though times have been very rough lately, I still feel inside of me I have this awesome reservoir of strength, comfort, peace, and that's all because of the faith that I have and the promises that were made to me in my faith and made to me based on my faith by my Creator. And having that inner strength peace it doesn't it doesn't stop the sadness or the pain it really doesn't because those things are part of being alive as well but what it does is it helps you have a coping mechanism now you may say, are you telling me the only reason I should have faith is to be able to deal with bad times? Of course not. That's not the only reason. It is a byproduct of your faith. You have faith because that's how you attain salvation. Anyway, I don't want to dwell a whole lot on there. You may hear some twinge of sadness in my voice today. But life goes forward. And so will we. Our mothers and fathers, and I guess this is not true for everyone, and if it isn't, then I don't pity you by any means, but I, when I talk to people who don't have the extraordinary parents that I have, it, it doesn't make me feel bad for them, it just makes me understand how incredibly blessed I was. You know, I don't feel bad for you that your parents weren't but I don't I think you are what you determine yourself to be I don't think 
no matter what color you are, well, no matter what sex you are, no matter how old you are, I don't think you should let anyone else, I don't think you should let any other human being determine for you who you are or what you have to be or you shouldn't let society hold you back minority groups are often um, argue that they can not um, be successful um, because of the repression of the majority and and as a society those pressures are definitely real but individually at what point do you stop and and, re, and I'm not I don't want to talk about racism right now because that's a different story I'm just talking about individual person no matter who you are no matter what color you are no matter what gender you are at some point aren't you responsible for your life aren't you responsible are you going to be the result of the things that are done to you all your life no matter what color you are don't don't you understand that you have to persevere and rise above the challenges that are placed in front of you regardless of anything else it doesn't matter about any of the other stuff all that matters is your choice we, we've really lost something in America we've come we've become a society where society is the dominating factor what happened to the individualism what happened to standing up for yourself being something that you can be proud of not letting anyone I mean I grew up in a, in an America where the American spirit was one of freedom and independence and I don't know I I find that going away in this country and it's just sad that is a sad thing because having b experienced both in my life and having experienced having neither in my life I think I will always choose to have them anyway off my high horse do I'm jumping off my soap crate right now okay uh, where are we well I think We've got to find Locke's skull. And I know that Locke is in here somewhere. I'm not sure where, though. We have to look it up. Uh oh. Am I aggroed? Why did you aggro me? Leave me alone. dead already. What's going on here? dead now and we lived so yay we we're able to take a bob two levels higher than us I'm not a skinner I thought I was a skinner I'm Taylor she make me a skinner these things can't be skinned uh oh now that can't handle I'm not gonna be able to do two in a row 24th level though. Where is it?
can skin this one, but I can't. So maybe Wash Washta Washta Pony is a named. You think? I don't know. I got a Washta Pony feather. This begins a quest. Okay. Cool. Awesome. Uh, might as well use these things that they're just taking up room. Where are all these things? How come I didn't sell this when I make them? Huh. There's coos. Cuz. 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 don't want to run between those guys. I was going to, but it just kept like, felt like the hole kept closing, you know? There's your main pathfinder. There's our main seer. Oh. There's a stalker. Who's this? That's Knack. Knack. I need luck. Lock. Too much aggro. So, what do we got to do? Well, we got to look up where Locke resides. So I'm going to pause the video just a second. You probably won't even hardly notice I'm gone. Be right back. Hang on. So, uh, what, so, um, it says, yeah, he's in the tent up on the hill. So, it's Locke, Locke Orkbane drops from Locke or Bane. So we have to kill Locke or Bane and then we'll get Locke's skull. And it's, he's in the tent on the hill. Now I don't know where the hill is. The hill. He's just in the tent on the hill. Well now there's a few hills around here right? You see a few hills? I see a few hills. But I have to assume I don't guess I have to, but yeah, you see that tent right up there? See that? See that tent right there? I'm thinking that may be what they're talking about. I knew it was up there. Because I remember seeing something up there the other day and going, I wonder what makes you go up there? You know, what quest makes you go up there? So, let's go see if he's up there. He'll be easy to get to. If that's him up there. easy to get to in that I won't have to fight my way through many mobs just to kill one mob. But 
I guess we'll find out. I wonder if we can get up there. Can you get up there? Can't get up there there. No, no, no. Hmm. 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 Well, it's definitely not lock. This is brain. Okay. Aha. So there looks like another, right? Oh. Windmill. Look, right there. You see that right there? I think that's a tent as well. That may be a tent on the hill, but now that means fighting our way in there. Yay. Hmm, be nice to complete that quest though. Be in a little trouble. Hopefully not. He's 
guy's pretty tough though. Low on mana. He's gonna go down, but can I keep him from running? He ran. Luckily, he ran not into someone other, some other mob, so I didn't have to fight a third one in a row. Okay. Whew. Man, this is going to be a pain in the butt. Oh, well. With strength, we will pers persevere. Only thing you can do, only way to accomplish anything is one step at a time. Gotta get the order correct. When they run up to you like that, you have to swap to. Conserve mana now. Conserve, conserve. Wish I had a root or a snare. Something we could make these guys stop running there. off today. Understandable, I believe. Well, this, uh-huh. I was going to say, this is neat. I can get past them, but I can't. working the way I was going.
Orkbane. Is he by himself? Appears to be. Alright, let's do this thing. <laughs> Messed up already. But maybe it won't kill us. Luck Skull, and we've now completed a quest. Awesome! Yay! And the trumpets go off. Do 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 do. Very good. Very good. Very good. Such a pleasing outcome for today. So we actually did two quests because we got this one, which I'm assuming will start another quest, but still. Cool, huh? Pretty awesome first day back after several days of absence. Several terrible days, as actually. Just some of the worst days of my life. And yet I am sustained. I still, even though I'm going through, without argument, some of the very worst days I've ever experienced in my life. I still feel blessed. And you may sit there and say, oh, your bad days aren't anything. You want to hear about a bad day. Let me tell you about mine. Well, the only response I have to that is, get you some faith. Get you some faith like I have. It makes a world of difference. I am living proof of it. What is this? I'm sorry. So, I can gain four extra backpack slots by securing my World of Warcraft account with the Blizzard Authenticator and an SS SMS Protect. The Blizzard Authenticator is a free, easy to use service that protects your account from intruders, and SMS Protect notifies you when important changes are made to your account. Click Activate to launch the account security setup website. 
Uh, four more slots? Hmm. I don't know. Might be worth it. Although I don't appear to be having a lot of trouble now that my bags are all eight slot, right? This is a wand. Hmm. And I have a wand. A flaring baton. 13.7. 15.7. This has no stats. So this one would be better, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's neat. That's not what I want to do. Um, so I think I locked my bars. What's that mean? You locked your bars? Yeah, so like if I grab anything... do a little goodwill here. Oh, well, he ran away from the hill. Sorry, dude. realized that was an alliance player. Why was it he... How did... Hmm. I wasn't able to cast spells. I guess I cast a couple spells and I didn't do anything? Because he wasn't PvP flagged? I thought that would PvP flag me, and it didn't. So I'm not sure what just happened there. Huh. I thought that that was a... I just assumed, here in the Barrens, that that would be a Horde player, but when I looked at the portrait, it looked like a dwarf. I'm like, whoa, is that why my spells were acting strangely there? Greetings. Rare beast of the barons, and its death can portend great fortune or great doom. But watch the pawnee called Spirit Fighter in Torah can bring neither or both. The pain you felt from hunting Spirit Fighter is the pain all feel who make great gains at great cost. The sting you felt is the pain of regret. But I can see you have conquered this. You have learned that regret turns to wisdom, and that through pain one gains strength. You have learned much, Utaka. We <laughs> shall meet again. Dude, I killed those quill boards for you. How goes your hunt? Thork thinks he knows the truth about who leads the raids against his people. But he shall learn how wrong he is if you are successful. My death is inescapable, but you have caused great pain to my enemies, so Mangle Tooth regrets nothing. It is done, then. Better it ends this way, says Mangle Tooth. They should have made sure I was dead when they turned their backs on me instead of leaving me here in this forsaken cage. 
There is but one task left for you to tenant finish, troll. Hey, it just made honored with Wargrimmar. Look at that. Sweet. Honored. Nice. Okay, clock. Take Locke's, ho take Locke's head to Thork in the crossroads. Troll. We, he should know what has happened to my tribe without any words. Uh, not that he would believe Mangletooth helped in such things, but I am sure he'll reward you for carrying out such a great deed. I will continue to bless you with Agrimorn's power for as long as I remain in this cage, Troll. Until then, farewell. Okay. We gotta go back to Crossroads, is that what it said? Peace, friend. Ancestors. Well, we can go to Crossroads. We haven't been to Orgrimmar lately. I think it's about time to take a trip to the big city. Sell our stuff and check our bank and maybe put up an auction. Maybe go see if we have a spell we haven't learned yet that we could use. Several things we could do. And I've got to keep myself busy today because lingering and doesn't work. Here is Thork. Sorry, I was. What do you need? Overwhelmed for a second. Yes, what is it? Here is Lock Skull. Oh, choose one of these things which you can't use. You found the Razor Main leader and killed him yourself, Utaka? Amazing. I am without words, but that does not mean I am without. Thanks. The people of the Crosswoods would do well to respect your strength. I must admit, I thought the leader of these raids on our supply lines was another Quillbore. Thank you again, Utaka. Which one? Leather. Leather. Intellect. Agility. Neither one of them can be used. Hopefully they're the same. Let's go with the tunic. No, oh, they're both tunics. Bark shell or dry moss? Bark shell or... Uh, we'll go with the intellect since Ooh. that's what I am, I guess. Blood and thunder! Soul bound, I'll never use it. Soul bound, we swapped it out. Soul bound. Okay. 
Zeus restores 832 mana. Hmm. I want to buy that. I wonder. Go for to victory. Let's go back over here. General supplies. Spring water. Milk. Huh. Right. Your blades never dull. Don't have any trade skills. No, no. Strider stew. Lizard tail. Do I know either of those? Crispy lizard tail. And it requires thunder lizard tail. Hmm. Okay. All right. Well, if we run into some more thunder lizards down there, we'll cook them. Excellent. Tasty. Let's see. What else can we do? Um, I'd love to replace my milk with... What was that stuff? Melon juice. There's a beverage merchant. Oh, oh. We got melon juice. Ooh, four. Four silver. Wow. And that's for five of them. But that gives me seven. I can sell those. Do I need to sell anything else? Leather. Gaia seeds. Healing potions. Something to eat. Need to pull this to here. Right, got my melon juice. Mana potion. Probably need it out there. Blood shard. Yeah. Get rid of those things. Put that on auction for sure. Okay. Well, I think that does all my selling. Oh, hang on.
Hey, so sorry about that. Uh, I was trying to find some help uh, probating mom's will and some stuff that I'm going to have to do. And I had called a friend earlier to ask for help. And that was a call back to let me know. And uh, again, just a huge blessing, friends and stuff that I have because of my faith. And uh, he let me know the information that I needed. Sorry that I kept you sitting there for those seconds. I'd like to go in and and delete that uh, time, but I may just leave it in. Sorry if you had to sit through it. If you did, then you get a special little treat right now. Yay! Well, here we are. Woohoo! Um, are we gonna go to Orgamar? You know, if I don't do it this time, by next Monday we'll have forgotten. So we're just gonna go ahead and go. And you'll just hang out with me and we'll go and it won't take too long. Blood and thunder. Down. Uh, I tell you what. Crying off and on for days is exhausting. It's just exhausting. People say, "How does how do you how do you live with it? How do you how do you adjust to it? How do you go on?" And I don't know that those, there are no good answers. I don't. Nobody's given good answers. To, I think there's only one way to do it, and I think people understand this. But we all struggle to find something easier, but. The truth is, the only thing that makes any difference is time. It's just the only thing that helps. Until then, you can't, until time passes, the runes are so raw that, that they, the pain is just almost unbearable. And nothing that anybody says really helps. You know, things that... I mean, when your world is just... When your life just changes in an instant like this. When there's a death, a loss like this. It's amazing how different your life is in an instant. It's very difficult to cope with. You know, it's hard to manage. It's debilitating and... And I don't believe that I could get through it if it weren't for the strength that I derive from my faith. It's the only thing that gets me through, truly. I mean, I guess if you if you don't have faith, I guess you can endure it. You know, you can get through it, I, I guess. Uh, but... I mean, grief just overwhelms me at times, but in those moments when I'm just not blindingly sad, I'm okay. I'm okay. So much easier doing this than with the mouse. Oh, the mouse is very difficult to run around those spirals. Let's check the bank. Why am I blinking? You see me blinking? Why am I blinking? Anybody knows what that means? Am I like... I don't know. Weird. Not sure why I'm blinking. Oh, oh. Okay, put this in there, put this in, this in. We got some silk. What do you know? Silver ore, a shadow 
gem. Let's take this and this. Wait a minute. Strength and honor. But it didn't open. Ah, nothing in it though. Okay, just making sure. Strength. Got it. Okay, we got everything that we need to get. And we're going to go over here to the auction house. And we're going to put this stuff up for auction. So what do I have? I have a 20th level leather shoulder. Armor, leather, shoulder, search. 20th level prospector's patch. Mm. I have a forest leather mantle. They're getting three gold. Wow. That's what they're asking. Huh. Three gold? And how much can I get if I sell that? So I could ask, I mean, I can ask two gold for it. How much will you take? How much yeah. will you give me for this? You only give me nine silver. Okay. Well, I can do some negotiating with that. Uh, spirit and stamina. Spirit and stamina, huh? All right. Well, let's sell this. And we're gonna sell it for 24 hours. Man, five silver deposit. Hmm. Huh. So our asking price is gonna be two gold. Our starting price is one gold. 99 99 to gold yep to gold shadow gem Or silver. Huh. Uh, so we'll start out at 80 silver and we'll buy it out price at 91. Come on. Up. Silver ore. Eh. We'll put a price of. 25 silver and we'll take a buyout of no really no 25 silver huh I don't know let's see if they're selling any I shouldn't run away let's see if they're selling any silver silver One silver for twenty, one silver. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. You can put one up like that. Silver ore. We'll start our bidding at seventeen and we'll take twenty. Create. Oily black mouth. There's some oily black mouth going here. I got six, ten a piece, roughly, five a piece. No, 
eight, nine, nine apiece. Well, can't do that. So if we have six and sell them at seven apiece, that's 42. Let's start here at 40 and put this at 42. There we go. And these are deviate fish. Deviate fish. Deviate, deviate, deviate. Backspace E, deviate fish. Deviate fish. 15 silver piece. Hmm. Can we sell these? Well met. 16 copper piece. Done. So that means only there was four of them. So it's four copper a piece was all they were worth. And he's asking fifteen silver. All right. What else? We wanted to go look and see if we have a spell, and then I think we're done. We'll close this video out. Tell you what, it's been really good to get back in front of you. I hope that you. Oh, I oh, can't drive with a mouse. Okay. I really enjoyed being back in front of you. I hope you enjoyed the video today. Um, I hope that in times of loss, when you face it, that you have taken some advice from someone, me or somebody else, and have found a way to have faith in your life, Go because it does victory. make a significant difference in the hard times. I just, that's what it's all about, you know? It makes a difference in the good times too, but it, it, it I mean, it does. It makes it, it makes a difference in all times, but I think maybe we notice it more in the bad times. We tend to sort of pat ourselves on the back in the good times and then rely on somebody else in the bad times, right? Undead, Resurrection Rank 2, Fade Rank 2, Mind Soothe. Only affects human targets. Level 40 or lower. Mind Blast Rank 3. How much is it? 36 silver. Mm. Fade. Resurrection. Shackle Undead. I really think Mind Blast 3. Maybe Shackle Undead. Fade 2, Mind Soothe may be the better one. Until we reach 40. Okay, well, when we reach 24, we'll probably have even more spells we can't afford. Yay. <laughs> I think we're starting to make a little more money a little more quickly now, though. Maybe. Maybe that's an illusion. I don't know. Anyway, um, 
I think that's about the end of the video. Um, I do have to pull up uh, these things. Bring Mind Blast 3. Mind Blast 3. And then what was the other one? Mind Sue. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I tell you what, 2020 has been some year. Amazingly bad year. Just an amazingly bad year. One of the worst ever years. One of the bright spots has been you guys. Thank you so much. I want you to um, encourage you to like the video if you liked the video. Give it a little thumbs up. Leave me a comment. I read them, and I do read them, and I do respond to them. Um, maybe not all of them, but, but I do read them. And um, please consider subscribing to the channel. <laughs> I've done that same thing, run and jump, run and jump. <laughs> That's funny. Um, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Uh, subscriptions are free, and they mean a lot to the channel. Just a lot. And I'm so glad that you guys are back. I don't, uh, that, you got, that I'm back in front of you guys because you guys mean a lot to me. And uh, having um, the ability to reach out and talk with you some t at times and maybe bring you a little entertainment that's that's uh, that's my goal and I appreciate it um, I want to encourage you to seek out and find a house of worship where you feel both comfortable and welcome attend services there regularly go there with an open heart an open mind a willingness to learn an expectation of family and if you do, I believe that that can be both a rewarding and a fulfilling experience for you. It certainly is for me. This week has proved it more than I can possibly tell you. And I so I deeply, deeply encourage you to do that. I think you can find something you've been missing, potentially. I know that I do. Something that it's missing from my life is fulfilled by my faith and I think it could be for you as well thank you so much for tuning in uh, we'll be extremely busy for who knows how long with we're still recovering from the trees that are down and chopping that and working all day long and and now we have a whole bunch of things that we've got to go through to get the estate settled and what to do with cars and you just can't imagine all of the I mean you probably can because you may have been through it I don't know but I shouldn't say you possibly can't imagine but it blows my the better way to say it is it blows my mind how much stuff I've got to get done right now but I rely on the lady who left us and she said her in her wisdom she told me that the only way to eat an elephant well, I think this is, it, it actually works a little better if you do it the way she did it. Son, how do you eat an elephant? How do I eat an elephant? I don't, I don't, un, I, I don't know. Well, there's only one way you can, son. One bite at a time. It's the only way that you can eat an elephant. And it's the only way to attack any problem you have. And it's a life lesson that I learned from an amazing person. And I give it to you freely. <laughs> uh, thanks for tuning in. We'll be back. Until next time. See ya.